What's up guys, Ted Matt here. So not a long time ago I promised that you guys I'm gonna build the Galaxy foldable phones and yeah here are they so in this video I wanna tell you guys what I built so recently I built these phones since the mid year of 2019. Of course these phones are not for me, they are for my brother. My brother is 9 years old and he's probably gonna get his own smartphone later this year and this is just a concept for him what smartphones could do. And also have a bunch of uh, smartphones that I've made, no unfoldable smartphones that I have made. So you can just watch the video down below in my channel. Okay, so let's go on and I'm gonna tell you guys what are these so the first folding device is the Galaxy Fold last year's Galaxy Fold released in February 2019 it was a cool smartphone first foldable smartphone that Samsung had made of course there are some thing had happened so basically this uh, foldable phone we have a small uh, chunky screen so small and then on the inside so big and the problem the first problem is because didn't get protection on both top and bottom in the center part and then basically the screen just came off and then it broke for the first generation they made and then they made a refined one and sold the refined one it was protected so no one would easily gonna peel your screen off so really good product so this is the first foldable, foldable smartphone lego foldable smartphone that i made really nice and yeah these pictures are all drawn from me according to the internet so i just copied photos on the internet you can see the details 5g 3 o'clock 14 degrees sunny day and then yeah all the things you could see camera play store the internet the mail and the phone it's just you know so beautiful i'm impressed i'm proud of myself drawing this <laughs> just kidding um yeah it's made from lego cameras are lego all the things are lego besides the paper is not lego of course um yeah moving on to the galaxy z flip so so, oh, I just want to talk about the price first. So this one is actually more expensive than this one. So in 2019, this one sold around um, 2,000 US dollars. So expensive. Now this year, they sold at 1,300 dollars. So pretty good that they lowered the price because this was so overpriced. So, okay, let's talk about the that flip. Okay, the Galaxy C Flip is here, Lego Galaxy C Flip, or you would call it the Galaxy Z Flip, whatever. It's just a futuristic smartphone, the second generation foldable smartphone from Samsung. And uh, basically, just have a even smaller screen than this one, which is kind of bad, I think. Yeah, so they say this one is you could see the clock, you could see the battery life, you could see the date, you could uh, answer calls on it. Like this is a hand gesture thing that you could use on it. And it does have two cameras, double camera, not like last year. They have three cameras on the back, one selfie camera, and then two cameras in the, in the inside. So on this phone, there's a total of six cameras and on this phone, it's only three. So two on double double camera on the back and then one selfie camera on the front. So for my own imagination, why they put a so small screen on the front is because if they put a bigger screen on the front, no one would uh, ever open this phone and this phone is useless. Yeah, that's my Im imagination. Um, yeah. This phone also had a hinge, but this one opens vertically, this one opens horizontally. Let's take a look at the inside. Yes, this is the pinhole design, first on a foldable smartphone. And yeah, basically, I, I love this color. They really have this color, the purplish pink color. It just looks gorgeous. So you could see we have black line at the middle. 
sorry guys I make a big mistake but simply I want to paint this hinge side to be black and then it seep into the center paper creating a huge mistake in the whole center part near the that that like directly into the center is black ouch believe me guys every single page like the home page you know the back glass use up around five to ten minutes for each so yeah use a lot of time and effort in drawing these but that was a big mistake um overall i love the pinhole design you know better than apple i i rather love this than the uh notch apple have keep their notch for three years and from what i can tell the the phones the iphones coming in 2020 this year they are still keeping the notch which i don't know the reason behind that i hate the notch you know showing the notch for a one to two years are okay for me but it's too long three to four years can you imagine it doesn't have any t sort of you know changes to it it's only the camera that has changed and then the f little bit features change but the screen did not change too well but Samsung did a really good job they really change a lot in their phone design making uh, consumers buying their phones you know more convenient it's more compact it's more compact day-to-day -day life and hoping to see the third generation of their galaxy fold and mainly from internet someone has told uh, like someone had written on the internet they're gonna came out with the second generation galaxy fold which means it's gonna have a bigger screen so coming the galaxy fold second generation so these two phones they are separate models so this one has a bigger screen where this one is smaller but more compact so these two are completely different models anyways thanks for watching guys make sure you subscribe like my videos make sure you give some comments and advice for me in order i can improve my videos and see you in the next episode peace out